Today on the menu we've got fish. Look at this, a beautiful whole snapper here. Got a really simple recipe for you guys. We're gonna leave it whole, we're gonna deep fry it so it's nice and crispy on the outside and that makes it stay beautiful and moist on the inside. And we're gonna serve it with a warm vinaigrette with all those classic Asian flavors, chili, ginger, coriander, and of course this beautiful soy sauce. This is good chow soy sauce, it's New Zealand made and it's naturally fermented. And this is off the first brew, so that means it's extra special and full of flavor and you end up using a little bit less in your cooking. Right, let's get on with the fish. Right, so we've got a beautiful whole snapper here. All you wanna do is just make sure it's gutted and scaled and then really important, just dry it with a tea towel. So you don't want any extra liquid when we deep fry it. And then sharp knife, we're gonna score it. Don't need to go all the way down to the bone, but just some nice even scoring. Flip the fish over, do it the same on the other side. And what this is gonna do is just help cook your fish nice and even and speed up that process. And I've got a little tip for you now. Get your wok on, get your oil nice and hot, but how do you know it's hot? So this is what you do. Get a pair of chopsticks, pop it in your hot oil, and then you'll see there, we've just got some slight bubbles coming off. So I know it's hot, but I'm just gonna leave it another minute or two just to get some more aggressive bubbling coming off, and then I'll know it's really hot and ready for the fish to go in. That's gonna be about 180 degrees. Right, the oil's hot, let's put in the fish. Right, so carefully, just lower it in. Make sure that head is submerged as well. If it's popping out, if it's a larger fish, just baste it with a little bit of a spoon and just make sure that gets crispy as well and gets cooked. So I cook the fish till it's nice and crispy. You can see that skin's nice and crispy. Flesh is nice and white. So carefully take it out, drain it on a tea towel whilst you make the warm vinaigrette. Right, now we're gonna chop some aromats for our warm vinaigrette. So a little bit of garlic. I'm just gonna really thinly slice it, but I'm gonna leave it in slices. Same with the ginger, and same with the chili. So I remove the wok, just be really careful because it's hot oil. Come back over, and we're just gonna warm a pan up. It's nice to use some olive oil now because that's just gonna help with the dressing. So we're just gonna lightly warm that oil, and we're just gonna saute off all these aromats. So I'm just gonna put ginger, garlic, chili into the oil. Keep that over a nice sort of low to medium heat. I'm just gonna bring out all those flavors. Okay, we're gonna add a little bit of palm sugar. Deglaze it with some wine. A little bit of fish sauce and good chow soy sauce. Just gonna bring that to the boil and then turn it off and just let all those flavors infuse. And I'm just gonna slice some spring onion just on the bias, just for a little bit of garnish and color and then we're ready to plate up. Right, what we wanna do now is a few bean sprouts over the top of your fish. This is gonna give us some nice texture. I'm gonna put a bit of coriander. Right, we're gonna spoon that beautiful warm vinaigrette over the top of the fish. We've got these nice spring onions there. And just finish it with some more bean sprouts and a little bit more coriander. And there you go, a beautiful whole snapper, nice and crispy and moist with that warm Asian vinaigrette using that beautiful good chow soy sauce.